Hi there, I'm John from cncroi.com and today what we'll do is engrave bamboo and we'll also darken it using our industrial laser. We do a lot of custom work in wood here in the shop and a common request from customers is to get a dark result. I did this cutting board a little while ago and you can see the first time I did it here without any darkening. And you can still see the results, but it's night and day compared to this. And yes, it's exactly the same piece of wood, wood it's the same board, everything's the same. So to go from this to this is actually an extra process that we do with our laser. Uh, straight engraving on uh, most materials produces a non-burned result. It's more of like an engraving, which is what it is. So you can see here, everything's nice and clear and sharp. The only difference is it's not very dark. Now a way around that is sometimes to do a paint fill and that kind of stuff. But on wood, you end up having, uh, sometimes the paint seep through the grain. Even if you do try to seal it, you still have that issue. If you look very closely, you'll see the seeping. So what we do is we put the laser out of focus and do a secondary pass. And the focus of the secondary pass is not to engrave more into the board, although that happens as a result, uh, just a little bit. The focus is to darken it. So you can see here, close up and this has got a layer of lacquer on it just to give it a bit more shine and here so this works great when you have a uh, wood that's a very light color like this bamboo here uh, if you have a darker wood like walnut it's a little bit more difficult because basically you're darkening already dark wood um, if you have a very light color uh, pine uh, white wood this is a great way of getting that darker result without having to resort to paint filling. Now the color is always going to be a charcoal-y darker color. You'll never get like red, green, and blue. That you have to do paint filling. So what we'll do now, we'll take a look at our industrial laser doing this work here. Generally when I do a lot of woodwork like this, uh, I always mask the surface and there's lots of videos of me masking the surface. In this case here, I didn't mask it on purpose because I wanted to show you uh, how much uh, resin and smoke residue and all that kind of stuff ends up on the board. Now the more uh, sappy or the more resin is in the wood, 
the more sanding is required to remove it, which is why we generally mask it. By masking it, basically, it's a layer over this, and all that stuff that came up over here would actually lay on the mask. You remove the mask, and you have a lot less sanding to do. In this case here, this is completely finished. So what we'll do now is take a look at me sanding this uh, to produce this result. this here was produced. Now application wise, there's a lot of applications where you want something darker. Uh, generally signage uh, made out of wood, you want something darker. Now the darkness isn't always the same. Let's say we're doing something in a very, very light material. Uh, let's say like basswood or something like that. The darkness will not be as dark because the wood density is not as high. So there are other factors involved with getting something extra dark. The nice thing about bamboo is that it's an incredibly dense wood so you get a really nice result on it even on very sharp details like you see the A here is very small it's about the size of my finger but you can still see it's clearly legible there's nothing rounded everything's straightforward and even the very small details like this are achievable with the laser so if you're looking for custom signage or custom corporate awards which is another application we do a lot of this kind of stuff with uh, contact me at cncroi.com or make something custom for you.